Hello and welcome to a new episode of Product Basics. Today I'm excited to present one segment of our products where our customers really think we excel. Our assortment of hinges used in the HVAC industry. So what's so special about HVAC doors and what is it that our customers like so much, you may ask? Well, the HVAC doors really have four challenges unusual in other industries. The doors are insulated, double-skinned, but the doors are made from thin sheet metal, often as thin as possible as manufacturers often want to save on material costs. This means you need to attach big hinges onto thin sheet metal. The doors are often big, but the thin sheet metal has a certain amount of flex in the sheet metal, resulting in a certain amount of give or bending that occurs to the door when a force is applied to it, even if it's just hanging in a frame from hinges. So simple adjustability of the door hinges greatly simplifies fitting the door into the application. In the HVAC industry, you prefer product that has so-called thermal break meaning that the hardware, the hinges in this case, do not conduct heat or cold through the door. Avoiding these thermal bridges where hot and cold meet prevents condensation from forming, prevents dust buildup and microbiological growth inside the air ducts. In other words, thermal break prevents dust and condensation from forming inside air ducts, and this in turn supplies the people in the building with better air quality. Service technicians often need full access to service doors, meaning that these professionals really enjoy if the service door can be open 180 degrees or even better, that they can be fully removed. These hinges address all these four problems, so you can focus on designing the function of the interior of the HVAC units. In fact, we have also included a handful of other smart functions in these hinges to make life even easier for you. We have a big family of HVAC hinges, and this is what they typically look like. This hinge type is a real workhorse, and the design has proven itself during the decades. The hinges are available in both powder-coated zinc zinc plated zinc or in stainless steel that's approved to VDI 6022 and is suitable to hygienic or offshore applications. The hinges are mounted onto the door using a supporting mounting plate placed in position via the four mounting holes in the outer door skin. In the beginning I personally never understood this little trick. It took me a while to understand that these four prongs should pierce the outer skin of the door. When the plate is in position, the plate is riveted, fixing it into the door. Then you attach the frame part with screws or rivets. Now, all our metal HVAC hinges are adjustable in both X and Y direction, so you can easily adjust the door in the application. The adjustability is intuitive using oval holes, so you don't need any complicated instructions. And if you want extra adjustability, this hinge with index code 3-163 also has adjustability in the Z dimension, so you can adjust the pressure on the ceiling profile or simply adjust the door so it looks nice and straight. And this hinge also is available in a heavy-duty version that's beefier and has rounded corners. It has index code 3-162. One of the secrets of the popularity with these hinges is that it will save you on expenses. You fix the mounting plate using pop rivets or blind rivets, making your thin sheet metal door two and a half millimeters thicker, supporting and straightening the door around the hinge area so you can save on overall sheet metal costs. Most of our customers using this bracket with a matching hinge make their door from 0.65 millimeter galvanized steel, equivalent to about 25 gauge galvanized steel, 0.0247 inches, saving 35% on material compared to using one millimeter sheet metal that was previously industry standard. The hinges are split along the center, and here is the answer to how you can adjust the door vertically and horizontally to a perfect fit, but should you need to completely remove the door sometime, the hinge will remember the adjustment. Remove the door by removing the lower part of the hinge and simply lift off the door, but keep the small washer in position. 
Now, here is how it works. When replacing the door again, the hinge will keep the original adjustment you previously set in the top part of the hinge. So, just hang the door back in position on the stainless pin and set the fixing screws. There is no need for a new adjustment. An extended version of this popular hinge was also developed for those of you that have obstacles mounted in your door that will interfere with hardware added near the edge. So on this hinge, the mounting plate and fixing screws are placed further away from the frame, leaving room for supporting bars or other things. This version has index code 3-161. Now there is another little secret in our metal HVAC hinge. It's the tiny edge. It may not look like a big deal, but instead of placing the full weight of the door on a few screws in the frame, the weight is distributed on a bigger surface area of the frame and supported by the edge on the frame. This both prevents sagging doors and several customers tell me that they have been able to switch from previously three hinges without the edge to only two hinges with this edge, even when using big doors around 1700 millimeters high. In addition to the above metal hinges, I also want to quickly show you two more HVAC hinges that are made from fiberglass reinforced polyamide, PA6. The first is like the previous hinges. It's surface mounted with rivets or screws, but has a quick release function, allowing you to remove the door without the need for tools. The second hinge works well if you don't need adjustability. This is the simplest and most economic HVAC hinge and it's made from fiberglass reinforced PA6. I recommend that you mount this with pop rivets or blind rivets. Read more about this hinge at index code 3-175. Finally, if black, shiny stainless or zinc plated is not enough for you, we can custom powder coat these metal hinges in your company colors, promoting your business better. So there you have it. If you're manufacturing HVAC units and need to open service doors, we've got you covered with all types of industry-specific hinges with all the built-in smartness you need. I'm very proud of the function and look of these hinges and honestly think you can't find anything better on the market. But don't be seduced by my presentation. Look at the hard facts. Our customers tell us they like the adjustability, the choice of different materials for any environment, the mounting plate that allows them to save resources by using thinner sheet metal overall, built-in thermal brake as it's mounted only on the outer door skin, resulting in a better air quality, the weight distributing edge that prevents sagging doors and often allows users to use fewer hinges, and don't forget the lift-off function that you only need to set once and that service technicians will love you for. Find the different types of hinges on our website industrialos.com and search for the index codes displayed by the hinges I just showed. Or simply search for Klimaflex plus hinges. On industrialos.com you'll also find new additions and updates that took place after I recorded this video for you. If you thought this subject on HVAC hinges was difficult and need help, have questions on any latching products, need drawings, samples, or want to discuss your application, get in contact with us. We have been in the business since 1981 and our customer service operators and business development managers will be happy to help you out. See you next time.